Welcome! In this video, we will see how managers can use and customize the attendance management module. The new attendance management module allows employees to mark their attendance by punching in or out from anywhere and managers to fully customize the module fit for their business workflow. To start customizing the attendance module, log into the FuelSense web app. Click on Settings in the sidebar. Under the Work Schedule, you can find the sections for Workdays and Shifts and Holidays. Let's start with Workdays and Shifts. Here, under the Weekdays tab, you can edit the weekdays for your office locations and departments according to your business workflow. To change the day your week starts, click on the Week Starts on dropdown and select the day of the week accordingly. Click on the Edit button to configure the different working days for different weeks, locations, and departments. For example, you can configure Saturday as a working day in the first and fourth week for employees in the customer support department of Mumbai and Pune locations. Here you can select one or multiple locations, departments and weeks that fit the particular weekday. To save these changes, click Save. If you want to cancel these changes, click Close. Now under the Shifts tab, you can create new shifts and edit or delete existing ones. FuelSense has a default shift already created for you. To add a new shift, click on Add Another Shift. Under the General tab, you can configure the shift according to your needs with parameters like Start and End Time, Grace Period, Half Day, Auto Punch Out, and more. You can also configure the shift to be the default shift. Under the Mapping tab, you can select which office location and departments the shift applies to. If you want the shift to be applied to all office locations and departments, Check the All Location and Departments. If you want to customize, uncheck All Locations and Departments. Then choose whether you want to map the shift to the employees based on their office locations or departments. If you choose to map based on the office locations, then you'll be shown all the office locations and the corresponding departments that are mapped to each of those locations. You can then individually select the departments within each location that the shift applies to. Similarly, you can choose to map the shift based on departments. Then you have to select departments and all the departments along with the map locations will be shown to you. You can select the locations that the shift applies to. To save the shift, click Submit. If you want to cancel, click on Previous or Close. To edit an existing shift, click on the Edit button. Update the configuration of the shift as per your requirement. To save these changes, click Save. To cancel the changes, click Cancel. Now, let's move on to the Holidays section. Here you can view a list of all the holidays within the current year. If you want to look at the next or the previous year, click on the Year drop-down and select the year you want to view and click on the Search button. To edit the office locations to which the holiday should apply, click on the three dots. Under the Locations drop-down, select the office locations respectively. To save the changes, click Save. To cancel the changes, click Reset. To add a custom holiday, click on the Add Custom Holiday button. Provide the details like the name, date, and the office locations of the new holiday. To save this holiday, click Add. Cancel this action, click Close. To simplify this process, FuelSense allows you to upload an entire holiday calendar. To create this holiday calendar, click on the Upload button, and then click on Download a Holidays Template to download a fresh template. Fill in the holiday data and save the file in CSV format. Click on Upload and Upload Holidays File. In the dialog, click on Select File and upload the respective calendar file. You can upload single or multiple files. Once you've selected all your files, click Start. If there's an error, FuelSense will provide you with the error log file. Make sure that the file is in the correct format. If you want to download the existing calendar holidays file, click on Upload and download existing holidays file. For exploring the leave management module, check out the video linked in the description. Thanks for watching.